Blackwood. So from what I understand, this is top-down horror survival. It has a bit of a... It, I think it deals with a lot of death uh, and monsters. I don't know what kind of gameplay this... And what kind of a, a horror setting it is. But there's just a lot of different people, a lot of different creatures. Um, I never got too... I don't think I've gotten too far into the demo to fully understand what Darkwood's all about. So I'm really interested in finding out. Difficulty... What's this? Indiegogo content? Additional cool but immersion-breaking content. Um, let's go for immersion. We're going to look at the prologue. I was I was in the mood for for something like this. You are playing a challenging and unforgiving game. You will not be led by the hand. Respect the woods. Be patient. Focus. Uh, good to hear that you're, you're going to be playing a game that is probably going to kick your ass. Looking forward to it. I think I'm going to feel like what this guy on the right feels. Complete in despair. Oh, um, before I move on, I guess uh, the games went on for me. Um, I gotta switch the game over, but we're gonna have to read the prologue here. Oh! As if I was responsible for the spreading disease. As if I were the source of all misery plaguing this land. nowhere to hide from them nowhere to run the woods have closed us off from the outside world we are all doomed cheery guy um i gotta switch the game give me a sec playing dark wood yep there it is and update so now it should say it on the stream and I'll also update There we go. I think we're all set. Now, uh, let's take a look at what we have. I don't know. I don't remember much about the demo because it's been a few years. Uh, you can drag chair. That's all I remember. Hills. Can I take ring pills? And examine. Notepad found. There is nothing written, but I can drag it around a lot. Fun. Barricaded window. Generator is almost out of juice. I need to find the full gasoline can. I saw a broken tractor to the east. Maybe I could find some gasoline there. So I remember 
from this game that it plays a lot on it deals a lot with lighting and sound so you won't be able to see what's on the other side of doors for example unless you actually have line of sight you can only select and interact with objects within your reach the interaction range is indicated by the color changing cursor the radio has been silent for years, and I missed what it said. The radio has been silent for years, although sometimes I think I can hear voices through the static. Okay, I have no idea if I should be bringing these. I'll open the front door to my house with this. Okay. Got a rag. Got a medical book. Um, wow, are these pages from actual medical books? Or these probably are made up uh, to make it seem like what the like the the game is like in the infection. I don't know. I don't know the real story of what's happening. Um, here we go. Am I able to mix these? It, it seems like I have ingredients to make Molotovs. I could open it with a lockpick. Um, I would rather not open it. I spent too much time to lock him in here. So there's someone on the, on the other side of that door. Best not enter this room right now. So, all right, so already I'm feeling uneasy. Uh, camera. Okay. Thank you for showing me a camera. My old medical bag. A useless medical bag. I'll just take it with me, by gum. Photo. Uh, not sure what that is. Uh, hold on a second. Um, I'm just, uh, replying to a message. Sorry about that. All right. I think I left the key in the wardrobe. If the cursor has a plus icon next to it, you can hold the left mouse button to open the selected objects. Go. Use key. Oh, God. I already want to go back inside. A large humanoid doll with carved out face. I'll just take this rope here. My dog. I don't think he's going to make it. I should end his suffering. Um, I don't have anything to help him with that. So I'm bringing a lot of stuff with me. Um, I'm thinking that I might need to leave some stuff here. Maybe if... Oh god, that... <laughs> no idea what that, what that was. My tools, they haven't been sterilized for years. The local patients can't be helped anyway. I'm thinking I should probably put some stuff in my wardrobe, especially the wood and nails, because I'm pretty sure I don't need it for something. Uh, rope. Uh, nails. I'll keep the medical bag with me, because who knows if I can use it for something, or maybe sell it. 
There's still a lot I don't know about the game, so we're just gonna have to blindly see through it. Press space to vault over stuff. Thing here. Alright, I see my stamina at the top right. So I have health. And I have... Stamina. Here we go. Can I vault quickly? Nope. Just gonna have to deal with that. Uh, wait. Here we go. I... Okay, so I got an axe. Um, with the weapon selected in your hotbar, hold the right mouse button, take aim. I need to figure out how to do that. Oh, so tab is opening my inventory. All right, I have to do the humane thing here. I refuse to let my dog suffer. Go in peace. Uh, wait. Go in peace. Uh, uh, the guy cares more about the condition of his axe than his dog suffering. Oh. It's telling me now to like drag this into my hotbar. Oh, that's it. Okay. Now I can put him out of his misery. Those with weak stomachs shouldn't look. It was for the best. These trees are growing too fast. Soon I won't be able to cut them down fast enough. So something to do with trees is what I'm guessing. Snare traps. I must be careful. The woods are full of them. I'm going to pick them up. Bone. Yes. This will be important. Trap metal. Okay, I thought I could reuse the trap. Found path. To access the map, press M. Oh, good. I'm here. This large gash is where I am. That's what he identifies himself as. Not a star. Not an arrow, but a, just a giant gash. Fallen tree. I'm guessing that there's like some lore every time I find something. But uh, it's not letting me... Uh, I don't know the button for that. You immediately transfer items, hold left control or left shift when clicking on it. Oh, thank you for telling me now. These parts of the woods are dark. To craft a torch. All right. I could have white torch or red torch. Cool. Put it on this. I'm guessing depending on what type of torch you use. 
it would la it would it would last longer or have like a a, a wider radius abandoned house oh my Okay, so the trees are the enemies in this game. They has to be. In a few days, it will be completely absorbed. So the trees are somehow alive or is feeding off the nutrients of, of the life here? Also, what the fuck is this? It's like an amalgamation of deer and, and men. Look at that. Look at those ass cheeks. Oh, this is the uh, abandoned house. I was wondering what this was. So somehow the woods are alive and whoever enters these woods uh, is doomed to be eaten by people. I mean, eaten by trees or, or something. I don't want to look at it anymore. There is a man dying. I think this one's still breathing. No shit! <laughs> You're not even gonna bother. If there's an exit out of these woods, this key will surely open it. Sure, dude. Sure. He's unconscious. I've never seen him around here before. He's only carrying a key and some journal. Since he managed to sneak in here, he must know how to get out. Of course, he won't help me voluntarily. But that... is of no importance. I need to get out of this accursed forest. You hear me, rat? Show me how that will let you go. Sometimes hear her voice. She's calling me. Calling me to return home. Where is the exit? Where? Show me where. Nice animations. For a, for a game like for like a like an artsy game, Jesus! I'll kill you like a dog if I have to. Fucker stole my key. An entry to a small cellar, maybe the pantry? I'm hurt. I could use these rags to craft some bandages and heal myself. Um, exit. Pressing one. Am I not supposed to use it like that? Use bandages. Oh, I can. I have a lockpick. I'm guessing I can use a lockpick on this. Use lockpick. It's heavy, but it has good reach. Ah, uh, yeah. 
Now it is time. Barricade's too strong to dismantle. So now what? Do I have to wait? Until he comes back? And then I whap him! Or I could just break it. The item's no longer usable. I need to repair it. How do I repair it? Found the syringe she used on me. Who's there? All right, I need to find. I need to find something to to repair this. Oh God. What is? happening So now I know why he has those cages Oh look at this Oh my Which on? Was he out of gas? Metal table with leather belt strapped on. That's not good. I can't even switch on things. Okay, I'm gonna turn around. He's not there. I'm waiting for him to refill the generator, equip the gasoline tank. Oh, god damn it. Have your cursor over the generator. Alright, alright. Over the cursor over the generator, hold right mouse button, followed by left mouse button. Tank is empty. Alright, asshole, where are you? I have lights! And I have... The corpse has two dials instead of eyes. His mouth is wide open. And I can hear a distorted voice, barely distinguishable from the radio static. Wait, was he here this whole time? Where did he even come from? This guy really is crazy! 4892 Oops. Hello? The door seems stuck. I need to apply some force on it. Apply this force! Help me. <laughs> ah! You motherfucker! I have a stick, asshole! This is what you get! A small plastic chick. The guy is holding a plastic chick. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? Anyone there? Oh, that was just him. And how do you want to get out now? You think you can manage all by yourself? Hear it.
What is that? And that was just the prologue. <laughs> oh my god. I'm I'm already into this. I'm already hooked. Alright, game, you got me. Bear trap under the window is still open. Looks like this night was exceptionally uneventful. I'd rather have an uneventful night than that. The use of mushrooms in the household. Yeah. I'm guessing they're just collectibles. A pleasant warmth was emanating from the oven. I can sense a strange yet familiar scent. It's the smell of the protective substance, which gives me relative safety after dark. The vapors rising from the huge cauldron are distributed all over the house via long pipes. As long as I remain inside my hideout, I have a chance of surviving the night. Examine the oven. Look at the weird bottle. When I arrived here a couple days ago, the oven was basically prepared. I just needed to light it up to ensure my safety at night. This cottage must have been one of our hideouts. The inhabitants of these woods don't need to inhale these, this revolting gas. The label on the bottle says, Staying out of the reach of the protective sustenance after nightfall results in immediate death in 99 out of 100 cases. It is advised to evenly spread the gas inside the sleeping area. <clears throat> so, we made a, some kind of stew or vapor out of whatever's in the woods. Warning, even a properly prepared substance does not guarantee 100% safety. Remain vigilant. It is recommended to stay in well-lit indoor areas in order to minimize the risk. Look inside the pot. A small, empty cast iron pot. I haven't used it yet. I haven't felt any hunger or thirst since the accident a few days ago. I can't stop thinking about one thing. These mushrooms, these red, pulsating mushrooms. They look so tasty. Maybe this pot will prove useful after all. Hmm. Interesting. A road home and a nail. Yesterday I barricaded one of the windows. If I want to stay here for some time, I should do the same with the other windows. Alright, we're gonna barricade. I do not have enough wood. Good for me. I now have mushroom. Because, you know, why not? <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Um, all right, I need to find mushrooms. Well, not mushrooms, I need to find wood. And I'm guessing these mushrooms will play a role in this game. Maybe. Generator is half empty. It contains enough gasoline for one more night. I should find a full can in the house above the underground entrance. Above? Wait. I should find a full can inside?
I should find a coal can in the house above the underground entrance. Um, okay. Apparently there's an underground entrance that I am unaware of. I don't think I need the generator turned on right now, so I'm going to leave it off. Because it uses up gas. All right, so I so my first act is to find wood. Melee weapons have a secondary attack. Try it out using the middle mouse button. Good for me. Poisonous mushrooms. I feel like I shouldn't be going out so far, because I should be trying to find wood. Wait. Here's some wood. Wood and nails and rocks. Alright, good. Good for me, I found some stuff. And I'm already out of space. Uh, 25 fuel. I hear dog. Dog? What are you doing? Oh! Oh, God! All right, dog bad. Dog very bad. <laughs> Fuck. I'm guessing that's what these stones are for. Yeah. So the stones are a second, a it's a makeshift weapon. I think I found all the wood that I can carry. Wait. Okay, so that's five. I think that's all the wood in this spot that I can get. Yeah. All right, so avoid dog. I thought dog was good, but dog was not good. Dog was asshole. can barricade one more place. Could also keep this here. In case anyone wants to come in through this way. Okay. Uh, let's barricade this spot. No. 
This one. Alright. Let's try something. Oh, I can't make it yet. So I need to collect enough mushrooms. I also need fuel. Shit, I should have repaired the well. And now I got no fuel. And I have no idea what the code here is. Maybe I'm supposed to learn it inside? Oh, howdy, sea bass. Make this. Trying to figure out this game. All right, I definitely need, need to go out then. I can't, I can't get the fuel because I think it's in there. But I can't really, can't really go in there. I mean, what did it say there was? No, it's not saying it anymore. All right. Uh, do you want to know the code to the box? I don't, eh, I, I mean, I don't mind you telling me what the code is. Oh, why did I do that? That was poison mushrooms. Oh, oh, good for me. Yes, please. I want to die from mushrooms. Ah. Yeah, I seriously need to know where to go. Um, I guess it's just... It's a patron thing, so I don't... So you won't know unless you're... Unless I tell you? Really? They locked it like that? 2919? Thank you. I didn't know that. I appreciate it. Oh, that's why. That's why it's a patron thing. They give you like a lot of, they give you a lot. Um, do I need to, yeah, I need to, okay. I probably feel bad if I just use the gun right away. But no, I really appreciate it. Oh, and thank you for following. I don't have the required resources. I oh, I didn't pick up the wood. <laughs> I didn't pick up the wood. All right. I'll I'll at least use the gasoline because I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, Where else to get wood? Um, you can't reload it. Oh, so it's a so it's like kind of like a like a starter kit. All right. Um, I'm also going to use the other... Oh, wait, I already have the second gasoline. Nails? I'll take... Uh, I may as well take the nails. Take the wood. And the rope. That's all, That seems fair, right? I'm, I don't want to make it too easy from the start. 
At least that's what I'm thinking. Although I'm already like... <laughs> I already feel like I'm cheating already, so... And then... I've been... Oh, I can give you... I can give you advice when you need it. Oh, thank you. Um, I would like to know exactly what to do now. Now I have the fuel and I barricaded my house, aside from this tiny thing. Like, I, I actually need to know where to go next. Is it just wander the woods and find something? Is that how the game works? Because I can do that. I am a master of wandering around aimlessly. Explore. All right. You, you said the magic word. I hear dog. Here we go. Burnt house. With dog. Destroyed well. It probably would be easy for me to um, explore if I if my uh, if my inventory wasn't full. Why do you only have rocks? Uh, I found the rocks, and that's <laughs> I only found rocks. Was there supposed to be a, a starter weapon aside from the knife and gun? Those barely do damage. Make a nailed plank. Oh. That's a good idea. There it is. Board with nails. That's the, it would not look like a board with nails unless I hover over it. Oh, I can make a chain trap, too. Mm, maybe I'll save it. I want to save my scrap. Maybe I can make... Some extra bear traps. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, let's go with this. Save the shiny... Oh, I can't save the shiny stones. Or, oh, these shiny stones are probably good for selling, right? Use your workbench as storage. It won't be able to be broken. Oh, really? Thank you for the advice. Let's I'll I will do that. That's probably a better idea. Uh let's put the oh. There and there. Maybe I should make a backup weapon just to be safe. That and that and, um Bottle? Maybe not the bottle. Uh, if the bad guys get bored, they just start breaking stuff. There are bad guys that just break stuff. Oh, is it starting to get dark already? Oh, it's starting to get dark. Did I just stay inside and sleep then? They all break stuff. Fair enough. Turn on the gen. That's right. I was I was just thinking about the gen. I was like, oh, maybe I should sleep now. <laughs> Switch on. Main light turn on. They can still see you when you can't. Also, you can't sleep. Oh. Oh, so you just... Really? I mean, I have a bed. <laughs> so, I still 
I still explore during the night because they said not to explore during the night. They say you die like 99 out of 100 percent of the time. Each night is five minutes, but it feels like forever. Oh God. I can't tell if it's, I can't even tell if it's day now. Oh, there we go. Now I can tell if it's night through the light. You will die to the floor gore. There's floor gore. I can't even handle regular gore. And I just played carrion. Like f no more than half hour ago. Oh, okay. Actually, the light through here can help me tell if it's a uh, night out. But we'll just, uh, guess we'll just hang out for a little bit. Yes, and it's invincible. Oh, God. Invincible floor gore. Sounds like a death metal album. Oh. So now that I'm waiting till sunrise. Ugh. I don't think you should run around your base. It makes noise. Then I'll just stand here for a little while. Now I could tell when it's daytime once I uh, once I see more light out. Or is it better to just stay in the... I think I should just stay in the light, right? <laughs> what am I doing? Yeah, well, I'll stay in the light and look outside. Alright. Okay. Actually, where can you tell when it's daytime? There it is. Oh no, that's just night protection. Is there like a day and night meter somewhere? So there's the underground entrance. They, So they told me that there's gas here. And there's a burnt house here. So probably once daybreak starts, I'll explore the burnt house first. Then go to the underground entrance. Just look outside. I'm already... I just, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, this stuff, this game definitely has a level of, uh, intensity. Oh, and if the door knocks, answer it. You may, you have my word, you'll be fine. Knock on the door, huh? I'll keep that in mind. So I guess while we're still waiting for for sunrise. I see dog. Please don't move that. Oh. <sighs> I don't want to spoil what it is. Uh, yeah, no, don't don't spoil if you can if you can help it. I would like to keep myself in complete fear this the entire night. It wouldn't feel like a horror survival game if you did. So let's try to try to break some tension here. Uh, how's everything going? My uh, 
lately I've been going back to Fantasy Star Online 2 with my friend. We've been, uh, my, my goal now before New Genesis comes is to basically, uh, reach level 75 with my character. Like, I'm really excited about New Genesis. What's that? Oh! Day two! Ugh. What the fuck are you? You were not here be you were not behind me a second ago. Even from afar, I can smell your putrid stench. Be glad I don't have the appetite for carcass meat. Carcasses meat. The figure hides its face under the hood. It smells of wet soil and fur. I know what you're after. I can help you reclaim what you've lost. If you help me attend to a certain matter, what do you say, comrade? As he leans towards me, I can hear him giggling under the hood. I knew it would interest you. Before we would make a deal, I need to prove that you can do the job. I've no time for weaklings meet, you follow. Show me what you're made of. Get through to the silent forest. You think it's so easy? If I were you, I would prepare myself well before setting out. When you get there, you'll find me in this spot. Remember it. The wolf grabs my map and scribbles something on it. The likes of you always crawl back to me. Let's show item. Photo of the road? That you got there. The wolf snatches the photograph from my hand and studies it carefully. Uh, finally, he snorts his thick yellow spit landing on the photo. <laughs> this road doesn't exist anymore. Overgrown with trees, like all the other ones. I'm grinding on Apex. I'm almost done with the battle pass. I've been on... I, I've been... Uh, I played Apex for a while. But, uh... Yeah, I quickly get bored. I quickly, uh... Not get bored, but I, like... I quickly get over... Battle Royale games after a while. Um, I know that coming next Tuesday is Fall Guys, which is another Battle Royale, but it's kind of a more um, a mini game kind of get, kind of thing, which I'm actually excited for. I'm actually planning on streaming that once it comes out. Uh, whenever you finish a night time will stop until you leave your base so turning so turn off your gen that's what i'm thinking too that's yeah it's best for me to save the generator for night wolf throws the photo to the ground better forget about the road home meet around here all the roads lead to nowhere that's a chick beautiful item perfect for a church fair ah he knows about church fairs if I were you, I wouldn't venture too far from here, unless you got bored of your lousy life, Meat. Only a few return from the dense woods, and those who made it back were not able to share their happy stories. <laughs> More gossip? Uh, I wouldn't recommend wandering around these woods at night. It would mean certain death for you, Meat. Better hide in the hideout of yours before dark, and pray for the morning light. I'd avoid getting into trouble if I were you, Meat. Or at least until you get a decent weapon. Uh, can I trade? I have some shiny... I have shiny rocks. Should I just trade with him? What has he got? Got yeah, a toolbox. A handgun frame, so you can make guns. Hey, you got gasoline. I can sure use that. Time will stop the gen so the gen won't use fuel. Time will stop so the gen won't use fuel. What do you mean by that exactly? Uh, oh, there's a watch. Oh, can I use the watch to keep track of time? That would be a great idea. That would be great for me. If you wish to spend some more quality time basking in the striking, yet natural beauty of my features, before you head off to the silent forest, you will find me in my camp in the dry meadow. The wolf points to a location on my map. Time is frozen, and yes. 
All right, I'm still turning off the gen though. I'd rather, I'd rather keep it off, I guess. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to trade. Let's see, what, what else can I trade? Nothing. I don't think this is enough, though. Because it's like 130? Let's see. Do 60 plus 50. Wait, maybe I can do it. All right, I can. Deal. All right. I got to watch. So, so long as it's in my inventory, I can keep track of time. That's good. That was a good investment. I'm guessing rope's not really meant for anything, so I'm just gonna keep it here. Okay, so I got bandages. What's this? Bandages with alcohol used for heavy, good for heavy wounds. Heals wounds, stop bleeding. I kind of, I might want to keep the dry bandages then. It's a good, it's a good, yeah. It's a godsend. In this kind of game, where you have to keep track of whether it's daytime or nighttime, yes, definitely. All right, so I got a few things to do. So I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna continue on with my uh, my goal here. I'm gonna get the burnt house first, then go to the underground entrance. Or I mean, I won't go in it. I'll just pick up the gas there. Then then it's to Wolf's camp just to pay a visit. I'm wondering what um what he's got there. Ooh. The alcohol bandages are better out better, but a little more expensive. It also doesn't stop bleeding. I noticed that. So I'm worried that if I if I make the alcohol bandage and I end up bleeding, then I'm like screwed. If I can I don't think I can sneak around him. I think I do have to take care of them. Oh! There's more than one of them! Oh, I missed! Eh. Die! I missed again! Come on, I dare you! Ah, eh. oh, I'll take the meat. It does? Uh-oh. Well, it said on the... Uh, it didn't say on the alcohol with bandage that, um... Or bandage with alcohol that... That it, uh, stops bleeding. But I can... But if you say it does, then I could just take your word for it and... And make it. Use the meat to extract meat eaters. Okay. If I feel like I, if I feel like I, if I feel the need for it, uh, pills. What else you got? Wood logs. Good. What else you got here? Now that I know I could take these guys out in two hits, I can be pretty fearless here. Those give you more stamina. Those? Are you talking about the pills? I can make more bandages. Uh, uh, maybe a torch. No, I have a. No, I don't have a flashlight. I thought I had a flashlight. I do not have flashlight. I'd rather have a torch. Uh, yes, pills. All right. I will get alcohol. Bandage with alcohol. 
So I'll put the healing items up there. Let's uh, let's make some try to sort things out if we can. Weapons, materials. We got the miscellaneous. Feel, yeah. Okay. What else is here? I'm guessing this is the only stuff. Okay. Already organizing. Yep. Yep, gotta gotta keep it clean. There should be another house there. Um whoops. Wrong room. Or uh, another another house. Oh burnt houses. You know, I gotta pay attention to the plural. All right, I might have missed it. It's probably for, it's probably like a bit north, if that's the case. I will take a quick look. Right, I don't want a lockpick yet. Oh wait, how do you make lockpicks? I forgot. Oh the. Okay. I think I have. Wait, did I have it back in my inventory? Am I in my storage? I don't remember, but I'm here anyway, so I may as well just uh, get the ho get the house I missed. Um, don't see it. Like I'm looking at the houses that's like within the fences. I already searched this house and the house over here. So where else could it be? Window barricade. Hmm. Red seesaw. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not seeing another house. Or is it not a bur uh, burnt house? There should be a house with a coach. A house with a coach. Or couch. Is it a couch? Uh, let me check the big house then. Here's a couch. E oh, nice find. White. A white dress? Don't want to know why that's there, but I'll take the fabric. Thank you. Alright, it is 12.20. I can make the trip. I can still make the trip over. The wolf's camp, at least. Oh. Can I disarm that? Worth it. Fabric is for hot bar and inventory upgrades. Inventory upgrades? I can make one right now. I need to upgrade my workshop. Oh, that sucks. 
Uh, upgrade workshop. What do I need? Oh, I got plenty. There we go. Um, I'd rather have the inventory over the hotbar. Yeah. Nice. You know what? I, I, I may as well get the fabric from the patron. Okay, that's, this is the last thing I'll take out of that, and I'm good. I'm done. I'm done with cheating. Cheat mode is now off. Wait, can I have another one? I can have another inventory upgrade? Nah. <laughs> Fabric is for hotbar inventory. Um, is it worth upgrading the hotbar this soon? Mm. Uh. Uh. Brain no work right now. Yeah. Mm. You know what? I again. I can always switch out stuff. I got I got plenty of things to equip. And I think that's it. I'll keep this here too. Alright, I'm wasting too much time. What a stinky cheater, not really. <laughs> All right, now we can make over to the underground. Is that me? Yeah, that's me. I'll take that. I'll take this. This is this is the house. I'll find the entrance to the underground here. Is it worth going to the underground right now? Oh my god, I almost stepped on that. Cycle between currently selected objects and press E. Oh. Oh god. It I'm so glad I got the inventory upgrade. Back the cigarettes. More matches. Oh, good. More mushrooms. No room in inventory. God damn it. I needed... <laughs> if only I cheated more. Uh, I mean... If only I had the space. I, I don't even know what to... I don't want to, like, leave things behind, but at the same time, I, I might need to make a little room here. A 9 volt battery get rid of the bullet you think it's not worth it I mean I don't have a I don't have the gun now but who knows all right so underground entrance I can go down there now however I don't have any space and if there's anything good down there I probably won't be able to pick anything up so I will have to make the trek back the rifle's not even that good. Well, good good to know. Sixteen. So, let's see. It's 416 right now. 
I'll hold on to this. I'm, I won't. I'll, I'll, I know what to do with this, but I'm I'm just leaving it here because I'm I don't want to waste too much time. I don't have alcohol. It's a storyline mission, so it usually has either really good loot or none at all. It's a 50-50 chair. Oh, that's a good... Ah! Woof, woof. I'll come back for the meat. Or not. All right, so... I spent so much time going back and forth, I probably don't have time to go to Wolf's Camp. If I'm going through the underground entrance here. That was me. I'm going to say that was me. Um, you don't need those flares and pebbles. They're pretty useless. Eh, a little too late for that. All right. A light bulb dimly lits the wet walls of the underground passage. The further part is shrouded in complete darkness. I need a light source to continue. Good thing I got this torch. Storyline missions also don't use time? Good to know. The thick wooden posts barely hold the soaked ground and the tangled roots. The construction seems on the verge of collapse. Hmm. Mmm, pulsating, pulsating unknown things. Love it. This part of the passage is blocked. Good. I hope one torch is enough. Otherwise, I might be a bit screwed here. Ooh, what's this? Oh! Did not expect this. Odd meat, huh? Yay! I'll just... I'll just put that into my sack. No, 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 no issues. No, no, don't think about it. Okay, um, I could save a little torch here. Locked. My only way out. I won't be able to open it without my key. Look at the handle. Press your ear against the keyhole. Look through the keyhole. All right. Press your ear against the keyhole. I hear a faint voice throughout the howling wind. It sounds familiar. It seems to be coming through the keyhole. Someone's calling me. The hatch handle is covered in a thick layer of dust. It has been opened for at least two weeks. Huh. Um, wait a minute. Some, something doesn't seem right. Um, from the prologue, I was captured by the guy who took my key, and then I beat the guy up. Oh, that's right. I never got the key from him. All I had was a duck, was like a little plastic duck. Oh, what's, what's happening? So where the guy where did the guy take my key? He couldn't have possibly have hidden it somewhere outside the house. Now you run? Oh That's that sounded bad. I'm just gonna gonna go ahead and uh, put this back. Give me a sec. Here we go. No evil amalgamations here.
Perfect timing, yep. Um, do I have enough time? Do I have enough time to reach Wolf's Camp and make our way back, or is it too late? It's, um... Well, it's 5 o'clock. It shouldn't be dark until, like, maybe 7 or 8. Ooh. Give me that. Okay. There he is. I can smell your stench from far away, meat. I'm sure you can. I have no doubt about that. At 20, it's night. Yeah. Um, alright. I guess I can't do anything about it. Um, what was... Actually, I forgot about the goal that he gave me. Oh, he wanted me to go through the Silent Forest to see his camp. Down there. Uh, that's not gonna happen till tomorrow, buddy, so, you know, have fun with that. All right, it is almost it's about two hours. Look, a squirrel. I'll probably finish up the day and then uh, I'll probably stop this stop here. I mean, stop at the next day. What is this? I remember this being next to my house, but I didn't know what it was. You know what? I I'm I shouldn't let the curiosity get the best of me right now. I know my house is near it, so I'm gonna have to there he is. I'd I'd rather be safe than sorry right now. hell is going on? You're hearing that? You need to hit the hay anyway? Yeah. Same here. Got another big day tomorrow at work. Oh, the generator. I got another hour. I got another hour. Oh. That would have been a problem. What can I make here? I can make a bear trap. You know what? I want to make a bear trap. I'll make two. I can use it for the bedroom. I'm going to put it right here. Oh, wait, I had it. Right here. Good. Okay. All right. Bedroom secure. Now I just have to worry about the other windows. And the door. And the loosely uh, made shift barricade called a wardrobe. You can peek through the wall. Peek through the wall. Are you talking about... Are you talking about through the, through the window or through the... the wardrobe?
I'm not sure what you mean other than I saw it. Oh God. Yeah, you were right. That was not a dog. That was definitely not a dog. Behind you? <laughs> Someone's rocking. You said if someone's a knocking, I come, I come a rocking. Hello? Ah! I knocked on the door, but nobody, uh, did I, did I not get to the door in time? Oh, I see. I see the door. I see the wall. It's on the floor? Ah! How'd you get in? Asshole. Did he come through the front door? He did. He was the one that knocked. Son of a gun. Oh, uh, you know what? I could have barricaded the door. Check the door. I will check the door real quick. Oh, I see it. We invite you to the celebration behind... The cornfield in the southeast edge of the day dry meadow. Good, cool. Uh, I need to barricade this fucking door. <laughs> what do I need? I need nails. I got nails. I got freaking nails. This, this is as good as barricaded. How will you get out? Um, I could just use the wardrobe. Go through the back. No problems. They can push that thing, though. Hmm. I'll I'll think I'll I'll think of my strategy. I'll think of a strategy next time. <laughs> Maybe just barricade and unbarricade the door, if I can help it. Like, I can dismantle it. Or, or are you just talking about, oh, someone's here. A ran roughly my size is standing before me. I'm, I am going to end, I am going to end the session here. I'm just going to talk to this guy just real quick. I can barely make out his disturbingly, that wastes a lot of wood. I started off with a lot of wood, so I'll I'll dismantle it. I'll think I'll have to think about like how to handle people going through doors. Stuff doesn't respawn. Hmm. I could barely make out his disturbingly familiar features through the matte visor of his helmet. Or matte visor. The massive helmet is covered with an old sack and seems to be an integral part of an unnaturally pale body. I remember him. He's the one who rescued me from the doctor's house. The man reaches out to me with his black hand. It's covered in charcoal. There's something written on his worn wool glove. We need to stick together, brother. 
His lips are moving, but all sounds are drowned inside the helmet. He shrugs, then takes the huge sack off his back and drops it to the ground, revealing its contents. He wipes his left glove on his pants, takes out the charcoal from his pocket, and starts scribbling. When he finishes, he lifts his dirty hand. All roads lead deeper into the woods. So now I can trade with him. See, look, I got the wood back. <laughs> and the nails. See, I never lost any materials. All is well in the world. <laughs> uh, oh, look at that. Hmm. All right. Well, yeah, I'll I'll make sure not to do that again. I won't do it again. So, um, oh, yeah, I'll stop here for now. This is a really this is a really fun game. I'm actually really uh, time since I saved twenty seconds. Yep, I'm good. Twenty seconds. Not worried about that. Yeah, good night. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely come back to Darkwood. It's it's it does it has a really great atmosphere and those those moments where where I I have no idea what's gonna come around the corner or what's gonna come from behind me. I love I love that sense of uncertainty in a horror survival game like that. So expect more of that. Uh, expect more of Carrion uh, later on as well. But um, until then, uh, if you stop by, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you all later. I have a stick, asshole! This is what you get! <laughs>